And I gotta hit play on the backdrop. Yo, 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 meatballs. It's your boy, Yeti Spaghetti. And this is round two of the Crate Room Podcast, season two. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed that first episode. Came out right on Christmas Eve. Hopefully that was a good surprise for you guys. And before we actually get into all the topics and the discussion, I just want to explain a few things. First is that we're going to be recording these ahead of time. So we're recording this now. It's not actually New Year's just yet. Um, but we'll have a New Year's episode or an episode at the beginning of the year or middle of January. And that'll be kind of more up to date. So if you guys give feedback on videos and things like that, we can't really see it. and It'd be kind of delayed. So like if you made a suggestion... It'll basically be two episodes ahead uh, when that feedback will kind of be um, used. And then I also want to talk about that we've set up the official Crate Room email. So if you guys would like to submit stories or need advice for something, you can send that to crateroomofficial at gmail.com. Um, I'll have it in the description so you know how to spell it and everything like that. And um also want to say we've... I had an animated background for the first episode, but I have uh, gone back to the old school gameplay. So we uh, that was a bit of much of an undertaking. It was a bit too much uh, effort. I know that makes me sound lazy, but it really was an undertaking to do that. So we're keeping it simple. But I also want to give that uh, opportunity to you guys. So if you have any gameplay that you want to submit to be shown on the show, then please submit that to the email as well. So now that that's out of the way, I'm joined today with... Dear friends, colleagues, Caleb and Ian, welcome back, fellas. Welcome back. Yeah. Well, thanks for <laughs> welcoming me back, Joel. Oh, my gosh. Uh, you just dox me <laughs> as I dox you, you guys. You just doxed yeah. like me and Caleb. Ian, so yeah, yeah. I figured it's okay. <laughs> it's only fair. Uh, also, this is going to be a low-key podcast because we all are deathly ill. Not deathly ill. I'm just kidding. We're deathly tired. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> like the coronavirus is like... It's in its final strand in my body. So <laughs> Caleb is whittling away like, as we speak. We waited till the very last minute because I'm like, guys, to I still got guys. the Rona. Like, it's not letting me record. I'm sorry. Guys, to save Caleb, you got to put your uh, credit card, your mom's credit card number in the... Uh, you, you just got to subscribe. That's yeah, I was about to say, just like and subscribe. Like, like, it, like coronavirus doesn't right. know what to do You're against right. it. With every like is one HP. <laughs> <laughs> one HP. <laughs> one HP. <laughs> Oh my gosh. He's got a big ass health bar. You gotta like that shit up. Can you talk about why you were yeah. so late today, Caleb, or no? Is that is that too uh <laughs> look, you wanted this podcast to be forty minutes? I don't think I got forty minutes to explain. <laughs> <laughs> well give us like uh, the I short can version. explain. Yeah. Um So two days ago was my birthday. And happy no, birthday. Was on a work day. Well thank you. <laughs> Even though I already wished you happy uh, birthday, but anyway. <laughs> well thank you again. It's nice to hear it like in a, reinforced. In a Discord call instead of a, a phone call. And yeah, it's reinforced and all that. So I feel extra special. The fact that you're willing to say it twice. Uh, but my birthday was on a weekday. Everyone's at work. Can't really do anything, right? So we decided to wait till Sunday to do it. So we leave at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And I want to go to a restaurant called... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, before you say that. You don't want people to find where you. <laughs> you might want to not it's say yeah, two that's states. Possible? Okay, yeah, that's why I started like slowing down. I was like, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Don't let the psychos place, find right? you. You love your pizza. <laughs> yeah. All right, so you went uh, to pizza. It's Papa John's. Yeah. Just say it's Papa John's. <laughs> dine in. Yeah. So dine I went in. to Papa John's. You know, their breadsticks are like the best breadsticks I've ever had. Right, and their cheese. That sounds like such a bullshit story. Now they know I'm lying. Like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, the breadsticks are not that the good. The Papa Diem. Like, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but they don't have a Papa John's where I live. So, uh, we went out of town. We went to one Papa John's, but they weren't doing, uh, dine-in. So you couldn't like go into the building to eat. It's like, okay, that sucks. So we decided to go to a different Papa John's in a different city. <sighs> they didn't have that either. Uh, they weren't allowed oh, to. So like, so it's been like an hour. We've been gone for like an hour, right? Like I woke up at three. We left at five. It's six o'clock. We're at the also, second. Also, we're Papa recording John's this place. at eleven. So if you have any idea of how late he was yeah, out, like, yeah. uh, <laughs> this is eleven o'clock so, just now. So so much later, like five hours later, finally doing this. So 
uh, we're at the second Papa John's, and we're like, all right, we'll just order it, and then they have a drive through so we'll just pick up the food from the drive through right? Uh, so we order it. They say it's only going to be like 20, 25 minutes. That's not bad at all, right? And we get like three pizzas and like fucking 48 breadsticks and cheese. It's fucking amazing. And, you know, we eat the food, right? Uh, so time to go back, right? It's like seven. I think seven when we decided to head back. And it takes about 45 minutes to get back home. Like 45, 50 minutes. And we're on our way back. And all of a sudden, like, low tire pressure gauge kicks in, right? <laughs> it's like, oh, fuck. And then all of a sudden, like, five minutes later, it's like you hear the... And it's like, yep, there it is. So we stop by a gas station. It's like, I don't know, 7.50, something like that, 7.45. And uh, find out, yeah, that tire's flat as shit. So, my stepdad call, uh, calls a roadside assistance. They say it'll be about 30 minutes. So we wait. It's about like... You guys don't have like a spare tire? They had a spare tire. It was under the truck, but like he didn't have the equipment, I guess. I don't know, to like lift up the truck. That's what I was confused spare about. Tire, I was like... Spare tires under the truck how do you not like carry that shit though? i have the shit in my <laughs> I, mean, I think it's different did, for like... i think it's different for a truck though like because we drive like rinky dink little sedans that you can just lift with your pinky i mean if it's like a four by four i mean you're gonna need like yeah. a big jack uh, it's for that a, thing a ford 150 i think or an f-150 that's not too bad actually never mind i thought it was gonna yeah. be like <laughs> it's like it's like a big red truck um yeah i mean yeah. Of course. Bed in the back <laughs> the and everything. Well, that's what most trucks have a bed in the back. I would hope. Well, I'm yeah. just making sure that, like, you know, I'm talking about the right truck. <laughs> it's not a hillbilly like truck. Maybe I like, get uh, rid of the bed. I... <laughs> get right. the oh bed on. Those abominations. They look so. So, odd. but then you, then you explain to me that you had to like, so you had to go to Walmart or something to get the tire so, fixed. Oh, that's no, 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 no. So like, we wait like half an hour. It's like 8:35 by the time the person shows up, and then they spend like another 15 minutes like taking off the like getting the spare tire getting all the equipment get everything set up putting the spare tire on and all that shit so it's like 8 45 when i finally get to leave or maybe it's nine o'clock dude i don't even know what the time is all i know is uh we finally get home but i haven't been to walmart this week so i don't have food for work or home or anything so i gotta go to walmart and they close at 10 apparently they close at 11 now but we thought they closed at 10 it's not so like it's the like, old days where Walmart stays up like till uh, open twenty four seven. So yeah. when I get off of work Friday night at three o'clock in the fucking morning, I can just go to Walmart. No, can't do that anymore. <laughs> gotta waste my weekend going to fucking Walmart. So we go to Walmart. Or they drop me off. I like speed run fucking Walmart. You know, five minute speed run, grabbing all this shit. Make sure you didn't cheat and, though. Uh, it was a million to one, like a trillion to one odds dream speed run. Did you <laughs> oh cheat? my god, <laughs> it's a dream speed. <laughs> 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 I totally didn't cheat. Uh, <laughs> so, you know, I get the new world record. It feels good. Uh, Walmart the speed is not run. That gets me of RNG. <laughs> uh, and I leave Walmart at like 10.05. And we got to stop at my mom's, grab some shit, drop some other shit off, come back home. It's like 10.30, 10.45. And then I text you and I go take a shit, brush my teeth. And then now I'm doing this podcast at 11. Yep. And you've woken up the whole neighborhood in the back, too. <laughs> yeah. can, uh, well, we can tell Kalubin's back up. <laughs> they're cheating. Uh, but yeah, so we're recording this late. That's why. And that don't... was only today. It's not even talking about fucking yesterday. Yeah, well, we were going to oh, record it oh. yesterday, but it worked out better to record today. Yeah. But it also didn't work out better to record today. But Because it turns out it was so late. I was, I was supposed to be home like two hours ago. But, like... Well. Just all is forgiven. At happens. least you're here now, and we all sound like nighttime DJs. So, I mean, hopefully people yeah, listen yeah. at night. So I get the full effect. <laughs> Getting that nice yeah. suntan from the blue light on my monitor right now. <laughs> Just pitch oh, black. hell yeah. <laughs> uh, well. Yeah, I left at like 1 in the afternoon Saturday. But it wasn't until like midnight when I got back home Saturday. What's the... like I left to go to a mall. What's the longest you've out of town? This I guess kind of goes hand in hand. Like been out slash stayed up. Like when's the longest you've been? Like what's the gnarliest? Like has it been like a trip or something? Because I can think of like, like for me the gnarliest was when I 
went to Orlando for the Halo Outpost. I drove back. I was like sick, and I drove. It's usually a nine hour drive, and I oh, did like dude. an eight and a half. So I stayed. Dude, like, we did a raid minutes. as soon as you got home. Yeah, at, like pro- one o'clock in the morning. That was probably the gnarliest I've ever done. So like, yeah, I know Huevo's was probably got some gnarly ones. Oh, dude. I mean, <laughs> I I've got like two right off the top of my head. Um, when I I like in August, I went to uh, Maryland. Uh, to see some friends and you know look at some possible like living arrangements and uh like i i was like at the end of august going into september and i don't remember what the hurricane was but they're like yeah there's a hurricane coming up the gulf of like two hurricanes at the same time coming up the gulf of mexico and like this is when i was still living in tennessee uh it's like hey that shit's gonna go over tennessee like exactly where you live and so it's like (sighs) i was gonna leave the weekend but uh i wouldn't have made it safely so you left the same uh, day because no i uh i was there for a couple of days and then it's like hey uh this is the path of the hurricane like it was like thursday or something it's like this is the path of the hurricane it's like and then at that point it's like all right well fuck i gotta go tonight or like you know tomorrow night or whatever and uh i tried to fuck i tried to pull a caleb and like fuck up my schedule sleep schedule but i i just couldn't mm-hmm. and i you know i went to bed i think i left friday going into saturday um but uh, I went to bed Thursday night, tried to exhaust myself all throughout Friday uh, and try to take a nap, um, you know, in the middle of the day. Couldn't do that. And so, like, it was just like I was up all day from, like, six or seven because I just wake up at that time uh, up until, like, maybe 8 a.m., 10. I don't, I don't even remember when I got home anymore. It's like Tennessee. But I, I, was, I was up for like 24 hours at least because it's like a 11 hour drive from Maryland yeah, to Tennessee. It's pretty savage. It's, it's, it's fucking it's... gnarly. <laughs> and so like, yeah, I, I I can I specifically remember like. But did you go home and do a ride though? Back. That's the that's the real question. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> part of the okay, drive. In that back, case, it wasn't like, as bad was, as yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> part of the part of the drive back, I was like struggling to stay awake. Luckily, I, I stopped and got some coffee, and that like that was like enough to keep me going. Dude, I wouldn't even forget the coffee. Just go do go to sleep. <laughs> even no, better, go sleep in the car, I, bro. No, I wasn't stopping. And then like the short, like short. This is a really short one. Pretty much like um when I was when I still lived in Maryland, uh. I would do sometimes I do weekend duty with the rescue squad, but I also worked weekends at a fuck it Staples. Like I'll I'll say it <gasps> Staples when I worked Doxed. at Staples. Doxed. Um, the cursed job. All the cursed jobs. The man. cursed jobs. I worked a lot of cursed jobs. Uh, rescue squad not being one of them. I fucking love that shit. Um, Next up, Party City, cursed job. Man. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's something we need to talk about on podcast. I know the cursed, man. Job. the cursed jobs. Maybe next time. Email in um, the most cursed jobs at yes, CrateRoomOfficial at gmail.com. Link in description. Anyway. The most cursed jobs. <laughs> uh, so, like, what, there was a weekend where I was doing weekend duty and uh, staples. And I kid you not, I was up for, like, 36, 48 hours. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, like that's pretty crazy. Staples and, it's between staples and rescuing. <sighs> so, it's like, that was a little, that was kind of fucking crazy. But I think like, that insane. reminds me of, like, like well, sorry, did you go? Did you? What was your gnarly one? I forgot. You didn't. You didn't well, I was say just gonna it. say, like, you know, I've stayed up forty-eight hours before, but like, all I did was play fucking video games. Oh my like, gosh! I didn't, I didn't bust my ass off. Bust my ass off at work. Oh, Two dude, jobs. I was fucking wired. <laughs> like Jesus. No, I just remember when. Oh, geez, if you ever wonder, that's you know the reason I disappeared off YouTube for a year is because I was just like, I gotta get. I gotta get late, you know what I'm saying? I'm just kidding, no. I mean, that was kind of <laughs> not the explicit reason. I just needed, you know, self discovery. So I was, uh, it was when me and, uh, spoiler, I have a girlfriend, but anyway, um, it was when we were seeing each other, like, kind of early know, on in the relationship. Um, and she lives, she, well, still lives an hour away. And I got there, like, <laughs> at like five o'clock or something. And we hung out. We ended up getting, like, donuts and stuff. And it was, like, 5 in the morning. Like, we stayed up oh to, like, God. 5. Or, no, it was we stayed up to, like, 3. And then I had to drive home. And uh, I get home at, like, 5. 
And I, I, I was like, I just can't pull in the garage. I'm like, I'm going to wake everybody up. So I just slept in the car for like two hours and then went inside <laughs> to like cap off my sleep. Uh, oh, shit. But it just, I was like, man, just the things we do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, actually, this is this reminds me. Um, was that she went on a flight recently for the holidays, so she's out of town. Hashtag freedom. Anyway, um, <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> no ladies, around. I'm joking. Uh, could do whatever I want. But she boys used this how, I would, for however long I want. <laughs> yeah, Caleb, you haven't had a lady for a while. Yeah. Yeah, you can't even really say that, man. <laughs> we might be thinking you gay. <laughs> it's, a, it's a blessing and a curse. <laughs> but no, she got delayed on a flight. She used Spirit Airlines, which basically you just pay for the seat. <laughs> yeah, about as good as Spirit, Spirit Halloween. Hot trash. <laughs> it's so, that's another scuffed job. <laughs> scuffed drive. Airlines. Spirit Airlines. Dude. Attendant. Ooh, wow. But it's so the, bad. <laughs> so the navigation broke on the plane. So they were stuck at the gate. Or the terminal for two hours. It's like what what navigation breaks? Like it's, just, it's the dumbest thing. It's like so bad. Oh, oh man, I fucking hate spirit, wow. dude. Boy, I can't wait for that to happen to me. But you're not That's you're not taking spirit. You're taking um American American Airlines. So should we? Yeah. I mean, by the time this episode's up, well, uh, yeah, we uh, uh we, we we'll have met up and then it'll be over. But yeah, yeah. we're gonna meet up for uh. The uh, New Year, right? New Year, celebrate yeah. the cleansing oh. of the palate. Uh, yeah. yes. Cleansing the re- of The reignition of reality. Um, exactly. And there'll be a lot of circle jerk. I'm just kidding. There'll be a lot of gaming, really. There'll be a lot They're of... fucking l- better, baby. be a lot of Lego <laughs> Star oh, Wars. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Lego Star Wars playing. That's what I really want to do. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I'll be down for Lego Star Wars. I want to oh, do something water. I want to do, like, a... I don't, I don't know how do you, you wanna... guys feel about your faces being on... You know the internet date night with life, but uh, what I do you want to do? Like, oh yeah, I was like, oh maybe I'll just do like a Twitter live, like for like a couple minutes. It's like, hey, <laughs> look who's here! <laughs> it's the boy. I was guess I would say you could do a Periscope, but Twitter's shutting that service down. So is it really? Yeah, is Twitter that a story thing. No, it's like uh, it's no, not that, story fire. Um, no, not that story thing. Periscope was like the OG live streaming app, and then. Twitter, Twitter just has a habit of buying apps and then killing them. Like they bought Vine and they're like, "We can't make money, kill it." And then same with Periscope. Like, as soon as they bought it, it just dipped in popularity. Because I mean, <laughs> you could just stream on YouTube on your phone. You could stream on Twitch on your phone. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I mean, you can do Insta once in an Instagram Live. Sorry, that's really what took over. It was like Instagram Live, Facebook Live. Um, yeah, yeah those two are really popping. And it's just like, and then Twitter. I guess you can do Twitter Live. So it's like, what's the point of Periscope? You know. So. Right. Uh, also, that reminds me. Do you guys see where Mark Zuckerberg sold his stocks in Facebook? <laughs> Did he? Really? No. Yeah, I forget who reported it. I mean, I saw it on Twitter, so that doesn't necessarily mean it's factually true. But yeah, right, uh, right, right, right. it just looked legit. This guy had sold, or this guy like took a picture of like the stock, like the stock records, and it said like Mark Zuckerberg sold stock in Facebook for like hardly any money. I don't even. It was like. Barely anything. Yeah, maybe it wasn't all of his stock, no, but it's probably like maybe a little bit. I was about to say if it's like, bare like all of his stock and he barely made any money off of it. Yeah, like, I could see. I right. could see him jumping ship, though. On Facebook and Is Instagram. Facebook plummeting. Uh, no, because I mean, it kind of Instagram kind of carries their company, I guess. But I mean, he's made his money. Like he could literally just retire yeah. and be done. Like, yeah. And he's. I think he's got. Well, I mean, he's got a wife and kid now. I think it's like. Right. He might be wanting just to like chill out, you know. Yeah, just so. chill and just worry about living for the family and with the family, you know, instead yeah. of like focusing on Android the children. That... Yeah, I was gonna say it's Fallout like... Four synth that is in the. Yeah. I, was gonna, I was gonna say it's He's like I don't Institute. know what kind of conspiracy theories you believe, but like the lizard one, the lizard man. I mean, I've uh, met some people like that. So I mean, right. it's just, it the, they just like they cannot types. be real. Yeah, they v? can't be real. They gotta be uh, V. Fucking the NPCs. V series wasn't it just called V? Are you talking about the main character in Cyberpunk? I'm just kidding. I don't want to oh, talk about yeah. Cyberpunk. Yeah, right. We're not talking <laughs> no, about was Cyberpunk. A, it was a movie, but then they made a TV show about it. It lasted like two seasons. It had the chick from uh, Firefly in it. 
uh, the sexy lady from Firefly. I don't watch Fire. I never she watched was like, Firefly. I don't watch dog shit Bruh. TV shows. Bruh, Firefly, what? Firefly's good, what? though. <laughs> Firefly's good, for whatever. It's got, yeah. Nathan, it's got Nathan Fillion, dude. Come on. You guys. It's like, gotta it's, be It's good. ODST before ODST came out. Like, how could well, you not like not, it? I, I've never watched Firefly. I have no idea. If it's well, I know what we're doing when we meet up. Just, it's got, yeah, like, right, one season. I'm bringing over fucking Firefly. Fly do, you, Firefly? do you have that movie yeah. Life, by the way? Okay. Yeah, yeah, dude. We're okay. watching it. It's date night. I was going to I was gonna buy it because I was like, does he own it? Should I, like, yeah. should oh, yeah, I, like I stock up on, my, like, like pizza? Or, like, no, order taquitos. Taquitos? Taquitos, man. What the fuck is taquitos? It, trust me. You'll you don't like know them. what a taquito is? What? It's like a chicken what? wrap with cheese in it. It's like super banger, what? dude. Super banger. No, just get like them. like a good mixture. I'll of buy them. I'll buy them. I don't care. Okay, dude. I need All to right. fix my, uh, I need to fix my... I'll just order Papa John's every night. I don't care. I need to fix my, uh, passenger side lock on my car, because apparently that shit's broken. I don't know what happened. I think, like, food, like I was driving around with Fupa. He just and, uh, busted it. He, I know. Fupa like, just I, I think, <laughs> he I think slammed he, up against he, it. He, like, rested <laughs> yeah, that's all he had to say. Fupa was in the car. <laughs> he, he, like, re- I think what Sorry. happened... Is like he rested his elbow on the line. I don't know what's wrong with it, but like it, it doesn't go up and down anymore. And oh so my I gotta gosh. figure out how to fix that. It's so dude. funny. The halftime man. <laughs> Crushed. Bro. I've had, you guys know John. Dude. Dude, oh, dude. dude. Oh, that's not Eli? I thought it was Eli. No, he just says. No, no, that's John. Eli's like, oh, he old. says Eli. Eli's on. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, that's Eli. No, John from the Call of Duty Monkey <laughs> video. He broke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He broke it's my. Months. He broke my door handle in my car, and I had to get it replaced. Dude, really? Yeah, he pulled it. He's like way too aggro, and like oh my broke oh, okay. my door handle. Oh my! God. I actually had two door handles break in my car, but only one was from him. <laughs> and apparently, they're, by, two, they're both by him. No, uh, no. John's actually he he also broke uh, my friend Andrew's door handle in his car too. He's oh broke. He's, yeah. he's like a serial <laughs> door handle uh, breaker. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty hardcore. Oh my gosh, that guy. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Dude. Uh, playing Xbox Live with him that one time was just great. I think like, he did enjoy it because he was getting memed on super hard. Yeah, that's... <laughs> of course we're going to meme on him. Plus it's golf with friends. I mean, who gives a fuck? <laughs> oh. oh yeah, hold on. Before I forget, Huevos, I told you that we have a celebrity endorsement. Right. We have a we have a celebrity that has um it decided to endorse the podcast. Now I'm going to preview this for you. <laughs> oh god. Do you see it? I see it. What is so, this? So um I just, you know, while while you were gone, I decided to make some context and uh so I got an endorsement from uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. So here we go. No. Hey, what's up, Nate Bortles? It's Arnold. I'm here with great news. You know, for all of the gamers out there, the Crate Podcast is back. It's finally here. Amen, I'm brother. I'm so excited. I could piss my pants. If you don't check out the Crate Podcast, I'm coming to get you, gamers. Don't worry. All the combat's got nothing on me. Now do it now. <laughs> In that epic edit okay. at the end. Now I just want to point out one thing. He's married. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. is, I saw the ring. Uh, just, Bless him. The Terminator found some love. They are human after all. And I mean, he didn't say crate room. Right. Yeah, said, I was like the crate podcast. It's, it's Arnold. I'm here with great news. You know, for all of the gamers out there. Amen, brother. The crate podcast is back. The crate, the crate podcast. podcast. But the Crate Podcast. I mean, I guess we got to rebrand, fellas. <sighs> rebrand. The Crate Podcast. Yeah. The Crate Podcast. <laughs> it um, reminds me of those like, uh, b- brands where they have like you know Coca Cola, right? It's like the iconic like Coca Cola logo, and then they just right. change it for no fucking reason. It's like, hey, we're oh, back. Like we're brand brands. new. The, oh, are you t- you're talking like no, the actual, actual main brands. brands do it? Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's we're weird. just doing the same thing, you know. Crate room sounded really good, but now we're just the crate, you know, crate podcast, the crate podcast. Forget the room; it's all about the crate now. Just the crate. <laughs> more crate, I mean, less room. <laughs> What's up with the if, numbers at the bottom? Even if, uh... oh, that's this that says cameo at the bottom. <laughs> oh yeah, it's, it's oh, it I cropped oh, yeah. it. I cropped it weird. Um, okay. Uh, e- even if 
uh, you know, he doesn't say Cray Room. I think, I think the cool. endorsement's still appreciated from uh, the it's Terminator. It's still very much appreciated, Absolutely. yes, of course. Thank and now you, I'm about to go down. I'm trying. I'm, I'm, I'm really, awesome, I'm really tempted to get some more celebrity endorsements. Is that the 800? <laughs> I'm really tempted because there's a lot of people on there that you can get for cheap. I mean, like you got Skippy the Virgin that's on there from like the TLC show. Skippy would be a fucking no dude. You got Shoe Nice. <laughs> it costs like 20 Shoe bucks. Shoe Nice does it? Yeah, no it's, like, it's like 20 bucks Dang. from Shoe Nice. So, I mean, we might get an endorsement from Shoe at some point. Um, that's nuts. He might eat us before we. Uh, yeah, I was about to say. I'm like, I'm not sure if I want an endorsement from it. Like, <laughs> bro, come yeah. on now. What do you mean, shoe nice, bro? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but like, have you seen what he does to like Ethan and Hila? Like, dude, he's just yeah, epic. It's kind of nuts for them, and they have security <laughs> in their house. Okay, like I, I, what, I have a gator. Shredder? That's my security. Shredder. Okay, and shoe nice is gonna Caleb's fuck up like, that gator. I have a gator. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, dude. Louisiana swamp area. Let the me tell you. Louisiana swamp area. Like, what a legend. Or is him? I miss that, man. I barely hung out with him, and I miss that, man. <laughs> right? <laughs> but I swear to God, like, I've told Yeti, like, a thousand times by now, but, like, he could show up one day, I could talk to him for five minutes. And that's all and I need. Be done. Because, yeah, that's all I need. Like, I... I love five minutes of Orzium, but like if we had to play like two hours with the guy, I'd be like, "Oh my god, I'm dying." So much character like, in one person, like <laughs> just... yeah, exactly. It's just like this is a bit much. <laughs> like I no. love this, but like no, I could. It's I too could, much of a good. Thing. I like Orzium a lot. I mean, like not. I, 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 I would I, want more than two hours. I like for him to be back like consistently because he's he's hilarious, dude. <laughs> but he got a life, so to speak. So. Well, he got a couple of jobs. He got a job. He got a job. And he got a lady too. So that's what that's what happened. He's got a lady. Yeah. Bruh. Hell yeah. Well, now we know why he doesn't game anymore. You could still game and have a lady. I know. I know. I'm talking. I'm, the, I'm talking to you. Even when your girlfriend isn't at the airport. So. <laughs> getting stuck. Yeah. That's yeah, actually why stuck, I'm here so. now. Uh, she's stu- it's like, she's <laughs> stuck. <again>. Currently. <laughs> uh, uh, feels bad. And apparently with Spear, they're not even, because when I flew safely, I like to preface that, like, oh, like, I traveled a lot this year, but it was safe. I'm not, like, a COVID spreader. Um, Super spreader. That's what blows my mind, too. Um, but, like, when I flew Southwest, they, even though it didn't really help, it still makes you feel better. Like, if there's three seats, they would basically put one person at the window, one person aisle. So, like, the middle seat was open. So, they would basically have three yeah, seats, right. two people. And then Spirit, they're just like, no, nah, we don't care about anybody. They just fill up the whole plane. Pack them up, yeah. It Pack was them like, up like sardines. It's just Jesus like, Christ, bro, man. Spirit. I was. I would. I would be. Wouldn't be surprised if Spirit Halloween also owned Spirit Airlines. I mean, they're both just so shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, they're just so bad. <laughs> Probably do. Even though I actually like Spirit Halloween, that's besides the point. But. <laughs> Oh, have you guys ever gone, done, like, the Joker Harley Quinn cringe ever? Did you guys ever, like, get roped into that? No. Because no. I, 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 like, I like to avoid cringe. <laughs> well, I mean, so it doesn't matter. I know, like, it's what you like. It's what the lady wants, you know? Exactly. Uh, I, mean. <laughs> I mean, I knew, like, a co-worker that wore the, like, Daddy's Little Monster shirt to work <sighs> and stuff. <laughs> and then, like, you know, back in the day when, like, Suicide Squad came out and, like, you know, everyone was loving, like, Harley Quinn or whatever. And they're like, oh, my God, I wish, like, I was in that kind of relationship and all this stuff. It's like, do you? No, not at all. <laughs> you don't want that. Uh, it's like the most toxic uh, relationship you could ever uh, be in. Like, I don't understand. But that's, like, as far as I know about it. But you've never done, like, a, a cringe couple's costume no. or anything. What couple have I been in? I don't know. The Ooh. gay kind? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's just... oh, it feels bad. Not even that, dude. <laughs> I saw, I was, on Twitter, you posted, like, sexuality question marks. I'm like, I don't know what to think of what was. Dude, I don't fucking know what I am, man. <laughs> what, do you be like, you see a guy and you're like, that guy's pretty thick or something? No, I just... I'm not I, judging I you. Th- I'm just... No, no, it's just... <laughs> I can appreciate a good-looking guy. Yeah. I mean, why do you think they invented uh, Ryan Reynolds and Jake Gyllenhaal, you know? <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Those are good-looking dudes, and I can admit they're good-looking dudes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And still be fine with the fact that I just want women. 
Like, <laughs> if, if, but, if, Caleb's but, like but if they look like man. Ryan Reynolds, I mean, that's a better. Is that a plus? <laughs> Wait, what? If it's like a yeah, Caleb's like, hey man. Uh, no, if they want say, Ryan Reynolds. No, I'm saying if, no, yeah. if they look like if they him, look if they like, like Ryan look, Reynolds. Oh hell yeah! <laughs> Could you hey. imagine Ryan? Caleb's perfect woman is Ryan. Ryan, uh, Ryan I can't even speak English, dude. Ronald Ryan Reynolds. Ryan, you know, just, I can't. I, Ronald my Reynolds. My tongue got caught in my teeth, so I couldn't see what I was saying. Ronald Fucking Reynolds. <laughs> Caleb's perfect woman is Ryan Reynolds with like giant tits, dude. That's all you. That's yeah, all he needs. I'm a simple man. That's all he needs. That's all it takes. Ugh. You know, I wish I could live my life that simply and <laughs> be happy with the simple things. <laughs> Standards are so fucking wrong. <laughs> I wish I could live that my life that slickly. Oh, that was a very uh, not subtle transition, but I'll, <laughs> I'll take the bait. So you may have heard, and we've been wanting to show this for a long time. This has like been top priority for me and Huevos because we're avid Snapchat users. Shame, but we are. And there's a thing on there called Slick, and it's like a haircut uh, Snapchat story. I'm going to queue it up right here. Um, and you may hear his joke like, the fade and the blah, 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 blah. Well, yeah, pretty much they give haircuts, and they're all stinking fades. But I tried to pick it's some always a fade. that were just weird, but I think they still quantify as a fade. So let's watch, yo. I just... And I added the music, too, so I made right. it even slicker. I just, I just want to, like, if you're listening and you're not watching, pretty much what's happening right now is this guy, like, with average hair, is going to end up looking like Drake or some shit. Like, it's every single one of these videos on Slick, dude. Promise. I hate it so much, man. Well, this one, it's a guy with frosted tips. Does he really have frosted tips? I mean, look at that. Doesn't, can you see it? Oh, yeah, true. It no, I mean, like... I see, but I mean, like, at the end, is it, like, worse? Oh, there he goes. He's got the number two guard out. Here it oh, comes. Yeah. Dude. What will his cut be? It's a fade. It's a fade. <laughs> now that's a new now look. Now that's a new look. <laughs> <laughs> look at that before. After. Before, look at that before and after. Okay, and then there's a, it transitions into another one. So this one, what will his cut be? Let's guess, guys. What do you think it's gonna be? I wonder what his cut will be, <laughs> Caleb. What do you think his cut? What do you think his cut will oh, be? Shit, man. You're right. It's a fade. This episode. Uh, <laughs> this episode's got me at the edge of my seat. Let's get slick. <laughs> Let's get slick. Let's get got the number slick, five guard out this time. It's got number. <laughs> oh, there's the number two guard. Check out those clippers, bro. Hell yeah. <laughs> you say you found this shit on Snapchat, Snapchat it's but on it looks yeah. like a Snapchat. Facebook it's video. A, it's on the. It's, on it's the probably on video. Facebook. It's probably basically. I'm subscribed to this on Snapchat, dude. I gotta get my fix of slick every day, every day, man. <laughs> dude, and then it gets better. Dude, look, look. Oh yeah, there it is. There, dude, this is. The, it gets even better. He gets like a shitty. Uh, it's all in the process, you know. He gets like a shitty V <laughs> or Z, and then look at the back of his head too. I might skip back. Look at the back. Look how crap that is. He's got like a little like triangle like a tail right? yeah look how yeah. just crap that is man yeah that looks like shit and then he puts cocaine in his hair <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah man uh, now, now that's, that's fresh oh, that's, <laughs> that's right, fresh, that's fresh. <laughs> My bad. and then he hits his vape at the end <laughs> and then he vapes bruh well dude. let's see if I, look at that you have that me until he vapes like no dude oh, that, that's just that's just all part of the process that's the slickest thing i've seen all week where's the i'm trying to get the the <laughs> rat tail like i just don't understand it why yeah why is it so that's like a reverse widow's peak <laughs> i know like peak what is up with end. that man it's just like a tiny little thing oh there there's a better view yeah that's why? awful <laughs> why <laughs> i think if you guys ever saw me with a haircut like that you have permission to shoot me on sight like uh, just <laughs> no doubt <laughs> well i mean one of these days i gotta give you a fade Yeti. yeah like i was unironically fade february thinking, like, if we ever hanged out like later in the year like my hair like grows out and shit. Just get fades. Just get like, fades. Let's get fades together. Like, oh let's my get gosh. Fades. Well, if like, you my hair will be long enough by like, summertime let's or whatever. Get we can do slick. it. Let's, let's get we slick. We gotta get though. slick. We can get slick. <laughs> can I, I come get... back to fucking where I live and like go back to work or whatever and they're like, what the fuck happened? Like, can I they get would a be Can I get a Z? Even more 
Can I get a get Z? A Z? Man? <laughs> yeah. Am I allowed to smoke some crack at the end of my haircut? No, it's got to be a J, you know? <laughs> a J? Yeah, you're right. Or oh, y. Yeah. J for your name. <laughs> it's got to be a Y. It's got to be a no, Y. Oh, three, what, a about, y. what about S for, like, Yeti Spaghetti? That's right. I get meatballs in my hair. <laughs> S for yeah. Slick. See, this one, he doesn't, like, start out with, like, frosted tips. What will his cut be, though? That's the fade. But then he's, look at this, they go, like, check out that parting, and it looks like ass. Like, it looks like yeah. he's the worst. Check out that parting. Whoa, dude. <laughs> crazy. Oh, man. Crazy, bro. He's got a fucking mudslide in the middle. <laughs> the mud. <laughs> Whoa, bro. He's combing his hair. Crazy stuff. Got Does every single video just what will his cut be? Not yeah. every single oh, not one, every but just single about. One, but just like, about. Just about all. And the barber's got the fade. Number two guard whips it out. Dude. He's got, oh, oh, he's got the Rick and Morty. Yeah, I just noticed the Rick and Morty fucking clip. <laughs> Hold on. Where were we? <laughs> it's right he here. Some regular clippers, like regular then, clippers. Supreme and clippers. And, Rick and, and then the ring. <laughs> <laughs> I think it shows it more later. Hold on. I noticed it too. Well, at least the skull looks cool. Come on. Show it's me the Rick and Morty. Classic, yeah, that's, that's a new look. That's a new look. Show I've never the Rick seen and that Morty, before. dude. I've never seen it before, man. Where's the Maybe Rick? Maybe it's like a New York thing. Oh, that's the wrong video. <laughs> you guys didn't need to see that. Whoa. Yeah, here it's the same there guy. Is, Rick and oh, shit, Morty. yeah. Rick and Morty, dude. Now that's Rick. <laughs> Let's get Let's Rick. Get Rick. <laughs> Let's get Rick. <laughs> Let's get Rick. And then he puts like a hand radio. Oh, geez, what is he like? Put a hand radio up against his head? He, gets, he, he puts that like 5G uh, cell phone <laughs> right next to it. <laughs> yeah, like what the hell Just is to that? keep him getting the fades, you know? It's, it's, the, <laughs> it's a laser hair removal. I think the problem is this thing probably looks better if you actually have like full facial hair. Like, way of us could pull it off. I, I would never get a fade, dude. Never. Yeah. I Cause the guy you... that's like cutting his hair doesn't look too bad with it, but like this guy just, nah, nah. <laughs> this is the guy who's like, man, uh, I'm like such a player, but then he he gets all his dates from like Hinge or something, you know. He's like, I'm <laughs> such a player, yo. I use dating oh. apps. <laughs> but uh, so that's, hey, you if you, you guys are wondering about the slick reference, that literally is in everything, or you weren't and you were just like. Not even paying now attention. You, now, now, now you know. Third eye has been now opened. Yeah. Now your third eye has been opened. You're, you have become <laughs> slick. You've been enlightened with the slick. <laughs> oh well, we're coming to a close, guys. I'm not gonna end it here. I would like to. Now this is the thing with the delays. I don't know if everyone's hey, like. Feels like we just started. Well, that's because we did a hour and thirty minutes last time with Noble, <laughs> so it, it feels Free. like it's forever. Um. So I don't know if the feedback, if they hate this, but I'd like to, I'd like to show you some more car crashes if you would indulge me. <laughs> yes. I, I got yes, about four please. here, so I'm just gonna spoilers. Well, I just they well, can't yes, see Caleb. it. Spoilers go on cars. Yes. Spoilers. So this first one, it's a third world country, and this guy's got a Ferrari for no reason. That's just Louisiana. <laughs> That's just Louisiana. <laughs> And he's gonna go uh, park it. What the hell's up with that window? Yeah, what's up with that window? Like, that's like a sport. Pause. That's like you got a, a window in your window. That's like a sports thing. Like they in, always... in your window. <laughs> Get it? Huh? Like a window. Like an Indian. Uh, I know. They, it's just. Ah. It's like a sports thing. So. I, no, I ain't about it. <laughs> and there's got to see the body pins too. It's like a, so it's like a sport version, like it's meant for like the track or something like that. Right. So he parallels it in a space that you can't parallel in, obviously. <laughs> right. Can... Yeah. And then uh, guy comes out of nowhere and takes his door off. <laughs> Yo. Oh. Ooh. Oh, that man just died on the inside. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that man! Hey, the white car is like wallet just died. Wait, hold on. There's <laughs> insurance. It's like a, it's a shitty Mazda too. Like the Mazdas are so oh, crap. Dude. I feel bad for you if you drive a, at least like a, before 2018 or 2016 Mazda. Because they just took the whole door. Okay. The door's gone. It wasn't even driving that fast. It was just gone. I know. Well, he opened it like super wide too. 
which is like well yeah so, so hey, so Han, it's, whose it's fault is fault. that though like whose fault yeah like whose so let's fault see this that, timing though? again hold on so this guy's kind of an idiot if you think about it like because he clearly couldn't see but then this oh, guy's dude. but then this guy's going way too fast in the area you know like the ferrari yeah, he's definitely going too fast he was chilling and then this guy's just like see you man <laughs> I blame the red car on that one, though. Like, he started opening that door when you can see the white car in the frame. Yeah. Like, that means he never looked at his mirror. He just opened the door. But wouldn't you right. be more cautious around a Ferrari, you think? Like, I don't know. I feel like I would, like, make... No, I'm cautious around, around every car, so... Yeah. Yeah, I guess like, that's fair. Okay. But you're just driving down or whatever. Like, you would think, he, like, the Ferrari guy would be more cautious because, like, it's such a nice fine car or whatever well, like he would be well, he's, also, like, he's also got like five did he, back up did he truck like, and like dented or whatever well he's got like five bajillion dudes around to like cover for him and i guess it's kind of these guys fault because he's got like his whole right, posse they didn't even stop him and they he's like yeah man you just pull, pull in right whatever. there and then you got a dude like two guys right there and right. he's just like okay man and then they didn't even like stop the dude but i guess maybe they didn't expect him to open his door right there so maybe it is the guy in the red's fault yeah i don't know Insurance experts, please write in to create room official at gmail.com. <laughs> Alright, this next one. No one dies. It's just a disaster. Now this is definitely the truck guy's oh. fault. This is brilliant. Oh, I always excited when you... the truck's fault. <laughs> should we should uh, we explain uh, for the people listening? Yeah. Um so okay. it's so a when we when we go to play it back, it we'll play it again. So there's a train, it's like a it's like one of those crane car things. Yeah. It um it's like it's hauling like a, train a crane. With like a, it's like a train and it's hauling a crane. Yeah. And then like, and it's like a truck with a bulldozer on the low. back tries to go in almost like go too early and then the crane snags on the the the, bull, the bulldozer on the truck and it tips it over and it's like catastrophic. Okay, this one I didn't add the music. Good. This one is like I gotta dissect this one. So I'll just play it through with the shitty music and you guys can, <laughs> can figure out. <laughs> The car the design is so shit. It's GTA 5. I don't like bro. the rap on it at all. That rap yeah. is so shit. <laughs> don't you love how he just keeps going though? Like, he just can't stop. <laughs> it's kind of a banger though. <laughs> so then you think he's done, but no. He's like, oh my <laughs> he's god. He's going for third. Bro. It reminds me when I got hit, man. You, wait, pause. Like, what is he what? doing? <laughs> wait. Is this a story you haven't explained, Caleb? What the hell? Oh, haven't I? I don't, I don't think have. so. The fuck oh is going God. on? Dude, <laughs> what is, now he's hitting another car. <laughs> <laughs> just so I think. Woman, run! So I think what. Okay, I'll let it play out. Okay, so, and it says WTF at the end, but, um, see, to me, what it looks like at first, it looks like this dude's salty, that, like, he can't use the gas pump or something, right? But there's, like, he's already had a gas pump. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I'm, at least, I, to me, it looks like he can't use the gas, but then, so, um, but then so, I think the on. lady's involved, like, I think maybe, right. like, she was like running around like she was about to get hit or something. Like I think that's like her. Like she was car. worried that he was gonna hit her. Yeah, I think that's like her car or something, right? Or like maybe there. Oh yeah, there she is at the beginning. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, hold on, hold so on. So I think that's like her car. She's like, "What the heck are you doing?" And then like maybe. Oh, that's right. Yeah, he's not even at the gas station. He wanted to use it. But then it looks like he wants Probably. to use it. But I think maybe this girl was like he, this one of the psycho so then he dudes who's like, to like move it. This girl owes me something. Like I miss you. Little, you know, Shauna or something stupid, you right. know, and then he's just like gone insane. Like an upset ex boyfriend or something. Yeah, and right. then it looks like he's trying to hit her or like scare yeah, her. Yeah, and then you she know? ran all the way to the other side. Yeah. Yeah, I think basically maybe this was like an abusive boyfriend and she like went to go run away and she had to go get gas and he followed well, her. Well, I mean, yeah, I think, I think you're right just because like they were recording before anything even happened with like the car, so like. Clearly, yeah, so he might have been yelling been, at her. There must have been some sort of confrontation. Yeah, there was like before. a prelude to this of yeah. some kind. And the, <sighs> the, the fellow's uh, knowing that the hey, this is going to be listening spicy. at home. Uh, pretty much, at home, they're at a gas but... station. <laughs> 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 the fellow's listening. 
uh, uh there's a guy a ramming a, a lady's yeah. like parked at this pump at a gas station she says she's not hooked up to the pump luckily and this dude in like a bmw that's got like a, a gta 5 Awful. wrap on it uh like starts ramming her uh her vehicle and then she like it looks like he chases her around the gas station and sort of i guess that'd be an accurate description <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd, I'd say uh, it's, right. it's a shame too with that car too, because it's white and purple, and white and purple is like a fantastic like color combination. Call me it colorblind. So I thought it was, I thought it was blue. That's just a bad design. I, I I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I like the wrap. I'm like call me cheesy, but I think it looks kind of dope. Bruh. If it was only red, like if it had like that, you know, urban, dude, like Mall Over Two urban look. Oh yeah. It'd be nice. All right. Well, I'll this is the last one. This is a bit of a, a fun one. Uh, oh. Here we go. Look, here we go. So it's the roads are icy. Oh, this is the classic one. Yeah, classic, bro. Right. Like I don't okay. remember what happens, but I, I know I've seen this. And then what's crazy is they get out. <laughs> Watch. Are you fucking kidding? Me? <laughs> look at this oh, dude. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> He's just sliding down the road. At least it's like a car that's not like a high damage. It's like a, uh, yeah. She's just like on her ass, like sliding down, just watching her car like slide away. She's like, what the fuck do I do? Like, <laughs> what you was the logic? Anything. Like, why'd you get out of the... I mean, maybe she tried to put her foot on the road. What to, is like, your foot going to do, though? Slide more. Yeah, people, people, people are crazy. Fucking uh. Flintstones in this bitch. <laughs> fucking yabba dabba do fucking... <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh i know man people are just what i was gonna what we only got about like a minute or so left can you can you explain the car crash story or is that a different another day story? it wasn't even really a car crash i was just sitting like i was on my way to my mom's and we're just sitting at a red light and all of a sudden our car like goes forward like, what the fuck just happened she just pressed the gas bro that's what's supposed to happen yeah like that's what it felt like and then it happened again and then Look I realized there was a you. car behind us, and it, like, hit you. us. I was like, what the fuck? And then it happened again for a third time. And then by the third time, I'm fucking pissed. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? I was like, why are you hitting us three fucking times, bro? <laughs> it was like what, some was dude, like... I guess, like, he went to go, like, hit the brakes, but then, like, he hit the gas. So then he went to go reach for the brakes, but, like, hit the gas again, or, like, some bullshit fucking story or whatever. It was just, like... But I guess, like, he wasn't supposed to be driving in the first place. Oh, fucking course. That's how it always works. So, it was dumb. So, and then I went to mom's, and then I went to work. So, I wish I had a, I wish I had a dash cam, because, like, just get one. Just, <laughs> yeah, some of the shit I see driving to work is just get phenomenal. One. And there's, like, a, like, there's an intersection, like, right outside where I work. And uh, it is it is just like an accident at least once a week, and I I wish like maybe I could submit something to the podcast. <laughs> yeah, oh, dude, shit. submit a car crash <laughs> content that you brought. You've already submitted that last one with the the truck and everything, so uh, yeah, yeah, submit away the intersection I live at too. Like we had a we've had so much wreck. We had a plane crash across the street from me, like a little what? like small, not like a big plane, like a small plane. It's like a private plane or whatever, like a small. Oh, yeah, okay. it's like a two seater. I mean, holy shit. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it was pretty. Like, what are you doing? That you just like uh, crash? Everybody? It was like at night too, so it's like, what are you doing? But that's a story for another day. Fine. This is all the time we have, guys. It's a pleasure talking with you. Thank you for getting on so late, even though this is kind of y'all's natural habitat. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, yeah uh, it is. It's not just... for me. I gotta work tomorrow. <sighs> yeah, no, I just I had no plan on being on this. Like I really didn't want to, and then you know, <laughs> life happened. So. It's all good. All is forgiven. But thank you guys for listening. If you've made it this far, be sure to subscribe. If you're not, I don't know why you wouldn't be. You know, it's kind of a strange thing. Um, and uh, tell just your listen to like a forty minute podcast with enough subscribe. And not to subscribing. It. That's just like that's kind of, that should be criminal. Honestly, <laughs> it's a little cringe, bro. Kind of. That's not slick. So <laughs> we'll uh, very slick of you. We'll see y'all uh, hopefully next week. But who knows? Yeah. Maybe 2021 will get us too. But all Maybe right, y'all. fucking die. <laughs> I wouldn't go that dark, but we'll see I mean, y'all. Hey, 2020 started with World War Three, so.
Who knows what? Who, dude, it's it's, it's up in the air, dude. Well, I'm ready for anything. Was it 2019 that started with the the Jake Paul? I, yeah. dude. I uh, yeah, I did. Dude. I think that was 2019. Uh, if it wasn't yeah, 2019, Jan- January 2021. I'm curious. Dude. <laughs> January is wild. All right. See you guys later. <laughs> later. Adios, fellas. Take care.